Hi guys! Welcome sa Engineer Math Channel. Sa video na to ay magre-review tayo for Engineering Board Exam Mathematics. So kung gusto niyo itong matutunan, just keep on watching. Okay, so this time ay magre-review ulit tayo for Engineering Board Exam Mathematics which is Calculator Techniques Part 9. So, dun sa Calculator Techniques Part 8, tinuro ko sa inyo kung paano maghanap ng indefinite integral. So, dito sa Part 9, tuturo ko naman sa inyo kung, pa kung paano maghanap ng definite integral using Calculator Techniques. Okay, so let's start with question number 1. We have integral of ln x dx from 1 to e. So, since meron tayong value, Doon sa lower at upper limit ng integral natin, meron tayong makukuha dito na constant value. So, input lang natin directly sa calculator itong mismong pinapahanap na definite integral. Then, masasolve nyo na mismo yung pinakasagot. Okay, so try natin. Okay, so gagamitin lang natin yung integral symbol na to. Okay, and then input natin yung given integra na ln x lang, diba? So, ln alpha x, then yung lower limit is 1, tapos yung upper limit ay ie, so alpha e. Then, press equal, masasolve nyo na yung sagot. So, the answer is 1. Okay? So, therefore, the answer is letter C. Okay? Next, we have Integral of 2x sin x squared dx from 0 to pi over 4. Okay, so try natin isolve sa calc -U. Okay, so since meron tayong involved na trigonometric function, dapat nakarad mode tayo. So shift mode, 4. Okay, red na. Then input na natin yung integral. So integral of 2 alpha x and then sin of alpha x squared from 0 to pi over 4. Then, press equal. Okay, so the answer is approximately 0 0.184. Okay? So, therefore, the answer is letter B. Okay? Next, we have integral of 3 raised to x over e raised to x dx from 0 to 1. Okay, so try natin sa calc -U. Okay, so input natin sa calc -U, integral ng 3 raised to alpha x over e raised to alpha x evaluated from 0 to 1 equals So therefore, the answer is approximately 1.051 Okay? So, therefore, the answer is letter C. Okay? Next, we have integral of 2 over square root of x minus x dx from 3 to 5. Okay? So, try natin i-compute sa calc -U. So, we have integral of 2 over square root of alpha x minus alpha x. So, in close in parentheses, then evaluated at from 3 to 5 equals, okay, approximately negative 5.98. Okay? So, therefore, the answer is letter P. Okay? Next, we have integral of sin theta to the 5th times cos theta to the 5th d theta from 0 to pi over 2. Okay, so try natin sa calc -U. So, dapat in rad mode uli. So, we have integral of sin alpha x to the 5th times cos sin alpha x to the 5th then then evaluated from 0 to pi over 2. Then press equal.
Okay, so the answer is 1 over 60. So the answer is letter B. Okay, so I think that's it for this video, Calculator Techniques Part 9. So sana ay may natutunan kayo sa video na to at maraming salamat sa paninood.